Let's turn to Adamawa State, where Governor Amadou Fintiri says residents must safeguard the state's infrastructure to sustain government policies and projects. The governor was speaking at an interaction held at the banquet hall of the government house in Yola. Senior reporter Ola Biadenusi filed in this report. This political interaction taking place here has participants across the 21 local government areas of Adamawa State. The social political interaction was orchestrated by Victor Dogo, the principal special assistant to Governor Fintiri on social mobilization. The governor who was represented by his deputy at the event commended the organizer for the initiative to celebrate the name of the man who she believed changed the name of Adamawa State. The changes we have seen, the policies from the brief we have seen on the screen today, the educational sphere has been changed. That there is no local person in Adamawa State whose son or daughter has not benefited from the payment of Waeg and Nepo. And education is the foundation for every development. And we're here to celebrate the governor who knows that education should be given to the child of the poor and the child of the rich together. The organizer in his remarks says Governor Fintiri would continue to live up to his reputation as a leader through his laudable projects. He also appreciates President Tinobu-led government for recognizing and supporting the efforts of Governor Fintiri. We all know, of course, that Adamawa State has come from a state of underdevelopment to becoming that center of economic activities. Many speakers shared their thoughts on Governor Fintiri's giant strides in areas of security, infrastructure, education, health, among others. In terms of infrastructure, in terms of security, in terms of advancement in education, in terms of employment, in terms of every other indices of development. We have said it before, we will continue to say it, that Adamawa State is moving fast, Adamawa State is today being developed simply because of discipline in government. The participants reaffirmed their dedication and support in advancing the legacy of Governor Umaru Fintiri through collective efforts and unwavering commitment to his policies and leadership.